Happy Friday, everybody. Welcome back. How's everybody doing this uh, this lovely, uh, getting a little warmer here in New York. On, uh, what do we got, less than five days till Christmas. Good to see you all. Good to see you, Rich, Chuck, Kathleen. Good to see you, Bonnie, Lita, everybody. All right, good, good, good. Looks like everyone's here, except the one person I do want to make an announcement to. We'll talk about him in a little bit. All right. Well, everyone, uh, hopefully everyone had a great day yesterday. We had a really, really good day in trading yesterday. And, uh, you know, it's kind of fun. You always notice it immediately in the morning in the pre-market. We did really, really good with the with the right aid trade. You know, and uh, most importantly, there's this one right here. We're looking at this M-I-R-N. But, uh, you know, want to go through some of the stocks that are moving and everything else. But just want to give everyone a little heads up before we uh, before we move forward on everything. Just remember, uh, if you look up right now with the upcoming events, you know, we have uh, the seven days deals that are coming on here at Cybertrain University. So uh, you can get it right on our website, right here on the homepage. So just make sure you go there and click on the seven days of deals. And, uh, you know, we do this every year. There's always something for everyone here. If you're a beginner, an advanced trader, you know, a new student, an old student, everything. And uh, this Saturday, I'm going to be doing an event on Trader's Corner. I'm going to be on at 430. There's going to be a big, uh, big event. I know it's like one week before Christmas, but you know what? Let's uh, let's let's bring it in for a bang. And then obviously we got the market closed on on Christmas. All right. So with that said, guys, uh, let me just uh, change the slide here. And don't forget about uh, <laughs> that's right, Ken. And don't forget one of the seven days of deals is obviously on the, is on your, uh, on Hanukkah too. So anyway, uh, let's talk about some of the stocks that we were trading and what was moving around. And then now I'm going to make a, I want to kind of like say a thank you to certain people that are here before, before we finish up and get ready for the trading market. Let's just start off first, talk about what we traded yesterday. Then we'll go through the watch list. Let's talk about RAD that we traded. RAD was a really, really nice move uh, yesterday. Probably the best moves in pre-market. And, uh, you know, I really didn't see that much. We, I mean, listen, you, you can't always get, uh, you know, uh, a big mover like this morning in pre-market, you know, like we did yesterday with Rite Aid. But you know what? You got to be there. You got to put in your time. You got to be at the right place at the right time. And sure enough, that stock really worked out for us. It had great Fausto flags everywhere you could see it. Just did an unbelievable trade. You know, I'm actually still holding it. Um, you know, after seeing what's happening, it's holding here pretty strong. This stock is going back on the watch list. You can see what's happening here right now in pre-market. I mean, the stock is doing pretty decent. And you know what? If this stock breaks out of this this new high right here at 1250, you can see some really good, uh, really good movement in this stock right here. So, you know, um, you know, obviously Wall Street really likes the news on Rite Aid. How does that affect us? I don't care. You know what? It's going up. It's going up. You know what? I'm just trying to put food on my table for my kids and, you know, like to pay for my kids' college. Uh, CBIO, another nice little mover right here. We did really well. You can see that one ran from 5 to $8. Better percentage uh, mover right there uh, on the stock. IMGN, this thing, once again, great mover, $3.50. became a nice little day trade, and then now it became a nice little swing trade. I'm still a fan of it. I'm throwing IMGN back on the list again. It was a great, great mover yesterday, and, you know, it broke all-time highs. And uh, you know what? It, all of a sudden, you know, when we're day trading, it became a little swing trade. And if you and if you did into design, which we talked about in the advanced class, phase three, you could see if you bought it and held it, you know, right now you'd be looking pretty good um, as a swing trade right now. But you know what? It's back and go, going back on the watch list. Another one we're going to put with, on the watch list, too, is we're going to keep an eye on U.S. Steel. Stock's taking some, uh, I don't know, not really taking uh, the likings of its news over uh, their earnings, whatever. But it looks like earnings last night was, you know, was obviously not as what they expected. And it is down. We're going to put this on a watch list. So, you know, U.S. Steel has got to be a little careful. It does get a little volatile. You know, a lot of us have traded in the past. So we know how the stock trades. But overall, you know, we only trade it when their news is out. And that's all that really matters. All right, now a couple of the stocks that are moving uh, this morning, I'm going to throw on there the TCON that I found this morning. This stock, uh, let me just fix the, let me fix the time frame on this so you guys can see a little bit better. A lot of shares trading on this stock right here. You can see it already traded over seven, uh, was that over, you know, almost 900,000 shares. 
It was up pretty big, you know, it gapped up pretty big, but it looks like it's coming back down. So I don't know what this is all about. So I'm going to pass on it, you know, until I see how it opens up. But there's a lot of action in it, and that's what we need. And the action is what the volatility, and the volatility is where we make our money. MITO, another one that's going on the watch list. Uh, I don't know what the story with this one is, but this stock just got crushed, crushed, almost 60%. It's up a little bit from where it started, which is a good thing, but it's all the way down to where we started right around here. So that one, and MITO, is also might get a little dead cat bounce on that one. IBEO is another one. Not doing, uh, you know, stock obviously not doing too well also. It's been on a really nice move, and then all of a sudden, bam, thing is taking a big dive. So it's right back to where it started from. Not really a good sign of knowing if it's going to hold here, but you can see here in the beginning of September, you had some resistance levels here. So it looks like it's testing that three, three, uh, $3.50 uh, resistance levels right there. NBRV, another one getting crushed is another stock i mean i think it's breaking all-time lows right here but it looks like it's testing this october lows we'll see how it holds up here but a lot of stocks are getting a little beat up and then oh my old baby you know favorite blackberry i don't know what the hell this is all about but the stock is moving this <laughs> is kind of shocker uh it's up two percent i mean not, not the end of the world but i mean it's nothing great I don't know, it just showed up on my radar, and I'm like, you know what? I'm seeing it pop up there, and I'm like, oh, maybe. So we'll keep an eye on it. But anyway, this it, listen, it's Friday. It's less than five days before Christmas, you know, uh, uh, this, meaning that kids are off from school starting today. I mean, this is their last day of school. So they're off for two weeks. It's a long time. And, uh, you know, so a lot of people will start going away. A lot of people start going on vacation. It's going to be one of the, they said it's going to be the busiest travel, uh, uh, busiest travel in the history. I guess it makes sense. Everybody's making money, right? You know, so if everybody's making money, what are you going to do? Sit home and do nothing? You're going to go and spend and enjoy it. Do those things you always want to do. So you got extra, uh, extra cash, which is great for all of us. So that, that obviously is going to probably trickle down into the 2000, you know, in, in 2020. So we could probably see some pretty good earnings coming on. But um, but just be very careful now as day traders. You know what? We'll get it. It's a great time to learn. It's a great time to start learning how to trade. And that's really what matters more than anything. Now, um, so there's, there's your watch list. Now, before we leave, ladies and gentlemen, get you guys, fellow traders, getting ready for the market uh, and get ready for the open. Um, I just want to make a couple of quick little shout outs really quick. Just give me a second here. Just want to bring something up here. And uh, okay. So just a couple of shout outs. First of all, uh, what we got right here. Uh, okay. So I'd like to do a shout out to Scott and uh, Scott, right? Scott is a new gold student. Um, had a long little talk with Scott. And he's from uh, from Oregon. Wants to be become a, he became a new gold student. Let's just give him a round of applause, hey guys. You know, Scott just kind of joined us. You know what? Been doing this for a while, and he says, you know what? Let me just do it the right way. And never took training before, so he says, you know what? <laughs> like I said, after the seventeenth diet, you come up and like, you know what? Maybe I should get some training. So it's great to see that Scott's going to be joining us. And um, we got one more that I want to welcome, Russ Morris. And Russ is from um, right up, not too far from me. He's, you know, he's, he's, a, he's a Florida native. Another one's going to be a, uh, looking to be a gold student. So congratulations to you too. All right. And I think that's all of them. Did I get everyone? Hold on. I think I, I, think I got everybody. There's a whole list of here, people that I have right here that I had to make announcement for. And uh, who else we have here? Yeah, that pretty much does all of them. I think that, that we got all of them. Uh, oh, no, no, no. I'm sorry. I can't forget my buddy, Dennis. Dennis, uh, Dennis Camp. Dennis Camp also is joining us. Uh, he's from here from New York, and he became a new gold student. Dennis, welcome aboard. Congratulations, being part of the family. All right, last but not least, guys, before we go, I just want to make two quick uh, thank yous again. You know, obviously, this is the time of giving, and if you've been here to OnSite, you'll notice she's uh, she's probably our longest uh, you know, a uh, favorite student. She's always here. She's always caring. 
She's a, she's a lovely woman. Uh, Lita always goes out there and comes to on-site. She's always trying to help everyone. She's the first one here. And uh, she basically gave her typical tradition here at Cyber Train University. Just want to pass this over to everyone. So she made, uh, she, she mailed us a beautiful wreath. She does this all the time. And she hand makes it. She goes in her woods and up in Ontario, Canada. She hand picks everything. She makes it, she weaves it, and she mails it to us. And I'd just like to thank her for that. The students love it. It's so beautiful. Thank you very much, Lita, for that beautiful wreath. We all enjoy it. And then, uh, and then obviously, you all know our good friend, Andrea. Andrea, our baker from, our famous baker from Toronto, always likes to beef me up a little bit, you know, but he makes the best cookies. And if you've been here on site, he always mails us a little package to all the on site. And there's us me eating the, his famous cookies, uh, biscottis, my little Italian uh, Baizan from Toronto. So you know, we're sitting there enjoying, I think I ate the whole box. So, uh, I know Ray. Ray just emailed me. Everybody knows Ray. Ray's asking, he's saying, hey, Ray, Faust, he's like, uh, hey, how's the diet going on? You doing pretty good, Faust? I Listen, I fell off the diet, Ray. After, after you know, Christmas, once around this time, I'm going to start all over again going into uh, January. But it's so hard for me when it comes around these times. But, guys, thank you so much. And everyone here in the office enjoys him and, every, and all the other things. It's always appreciated. And you know what? That's what it's all about. We're very close. We're a tight family. And you know what? This is a time of giving, and everyone should look forward to doing that, all right, everyone? So every, anyway, good luck, everyone. Happy trading. And uh, like I said, see something, say something. And for all our new students that are here also, we have a lot of new members that are trying it out. Listen, is what you get. Uh, what you see is what you get. So, But most importantly, let's try to make money together. Good luck, everyone. Happy trading.